while writing the definitions and understanding the perspective you would have realized that definition of quality is not universal many quality gurus have given their own definitions philip crosby has said that quality is conformance to requirements for example if you have ordered a bluetooth mouse red bluetooth mouse if it is anything different than that it won't be conforming to your requirements and that is why you would say that it is not a good quality another definition given by joseph m juran is that quality is fitness for use just think if your car is giving you good mileage on your frequent and long trips wouldn't that be fit for your use here we come to an end to this lesson let us quickly recap what did we learn so far we learned that perception of quality varies from person to person we also saw various ways to define quality based on five perspectives we learned about key quality attributes and at the end we saw common definitions of quality congratulations as you have finished the first lesson the very basic step in the quality journey and the next lesson is on evolution of quality wherein we will discuss the evolution of quality management throughout a century and we'll see some historical aspects of that thanks for watching this video see you in the next lesson